Oftentimes, an overheated catalytic converter happens due to excess hydrocarbon found in the exhaust stream of a car. This occurs when unburned fuel enters the car converter and burns, creating intense heat. Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'll discuss the overheated catalytic converter and its symptoms. Excess unburned fuel in the exhaust system is the most likely cause of a clogged or damaged car converter. Some of the reasons for clogged car converter, which leads to overheating, may include, restricted flow. A faulty car converter can stop the natural flow of exhaust emissions in a vehicle's engine. This will increase the back pressure around the vehicle's engine leading to overheating. The gases in the exhaust will be pushed out of the vehicle's engine by the pistons, pass through the exhaust, and then flow out of the vehicle's tailpipe. When there's any obstruction or blockage along the way, it could become a problem for the vehicle's engine. The second is an overworked engine. Exhaust pressure building up within a vehicle's engine will compromise the normal combustion. In every car engine functioning normally, combustion occurs at precise times and in incorrect amounts. When a catalytic converter is faulty or bad, it can disrupt an engine's normal combustion properties, forcing the car engine to work harder under challenging conditions to emit burned exhaust gases. Whenever this occurs, it will raise the operating temperature of such an engine, and once you leave it untreated, it can cause overheating to your car's engine. The third is disruption of air and fuel mixture. All vehicle engines need a delicate balance of fuel and air to function correctly. A faulty car converter that alters the combustion properties and ratios of a vehicle's engine could alter the exact air and fuel mixture, leading to overheating and poor engine performance. Here are the symptoms of a faulty catalytic converter that can lead to an overheated engine. A slow engine performance, reduction in acceleration, dark smoke via the exhaust system, sulfur or rotten egg smell from the exhaust system, and excessive heat under the car can also cause the catalytic converter engine to overheat. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. This could be because they sometimes get clogged, damaged, and contaminated, which could cause a reduction in how the engine performs. Although a catalytic converter happens to be one of the long-lasting components in the vehicle exhaust system, the problem with a car converter are, leaded fuel contamination, engine overheating caused by incomplete combustion or a failure in the oxygen sensor. As you know, the car converter duty is vital in your car's exhaust system. This is because it prevents environmental pollution as it helps to convert harmful substances within the exhaust system into safer compounds. But can a bad catalytic converter cause a car to shut off? My answer is yes, a bad catalytic converter can make a vehicle stall. Sometimes this can happen once you press the acceleration pedal. There are symptoms of a bad catalytic converter. Normally, a catalytic converter is supposed to last throughout the car's lifetime but can go bad sometimes and must be replaced. Sometimes this happens in older cars whenever the car converter becomes clogged. When this happens, the vehicle's exhaust gases won't be able to go through to the muffler and then out of the vehicle. As time passes, your vehicle can also use all the metals that work as the catalysts in the converter, which could cause the converter to fail completely. But how do you know when the catalytic converter requires replacement or repairs? There are five common symptoms of a bad catalytic converter which include 1. Reduced acceleration power Whenever your car is losing power while going uphill or accelerating, there are chances that your car converter is clogged. Most mechanics fail to diagnose what caused the acceleration power loss, which could be where the car converter was partially obstructed. Check the exhaust status to determine if your catalytic converter is clogged. You can do this by placing your hand at the tailpipe while someone else holds the vehicle's RPM at around 1800 and 2000. After doing this, if you notice a hot exhaust flow, then it means your catalytic converter is clogged. 2. Engine misfires a misfiring engine is one of the common symptoms of a bad catalytic converter. When your vehicle misfires, it shows incomplete combustion within the cylinder and that the car converter is not functioning effectively. Normally, any clogged car converter will overheat and could damage your vehicle's engine. So whenever you experience an engine misfire, immediately contact a reliable mechanic for catalytic converter repair or replacement services. 3. Increased Emissions when you have an increase in carbon emission from your vehicle's exhaust, it is a symptom of a bad or failing catalytic converter. Once the car's cat converter is faulty, then it won't reduce the number of emission gases within the exhaust system. 
4. Reduction in engine performance One other symptom of a bad catalytic converter is degraded engine performance. When a car's catalytic converter fails, it will create significant back pressure, which lowers how your car's engine performs. 5. An illuminated check engine light You will have your check engine light illuminated, but there are many reasons why the check engine light will illuminate on your car's dashboard, and a bad catalytic converter is one of them. So whenever the check engine light appears in your dash, it simply indicates that the converter isn't working well. How do you diagnose a bad catalytic converter? Whenever the catalytic converter doesn't work, the compounds exhausted from the vehicle will be more harmful to the environment. A decreased engine power due to a bad car converter will cause the tachometer to be showing lower RPM reading. Another thing is, try tracking the fuel mileage obtained by your vehicle. Examine and observe the temperature of your vehicle's engine. When any car's engine efficiency with a bad catalytic converter is reduced, it could cause the energy that's supposed to be used to power the vehicle becomes heat. The catalytic converter needs the right mixture of exhaust gases at just the right temperature. When anything causes the mixture or temperature to change, it could cause the cat converter to perform less and fail faster. In this video, I have shown you the best way to fix car overheating caused by a bad catalytic converter, and we have also discussed how a catalytic converter can cause an engine to overheat. See you next time.